So summer camp participants made a special visit to Guaranteed Rate Field. They're experiencing the ballpark an entirely new way through touch and sound. CBS2 photojournalist Lana Hinshaw Clan tagged along. White Sox, White Sox, go, go, White Sox. Is everybody ready? I'm going to cry. White Sox. We were invited to come do this tactile tour with the White Sox, and my campers are students from 6th through 12th grade. We've got special privilege today. You're going to follow me. Put yourself in their space. You know, kind of close your eyes and think to yourself, how do I describe this to somebody that doesn't have vision? Their eye is on that ball and you're coming onto this gravel area. There's a wall right behind you. I have tumors on my optic nerves and then I have, I have six brain tumors total. Thankfully I can see right now, but I do know braille and I'm learning white cane skills. The biggest thing is connecting with other kids with low vision or have the same eye condition they never knew they had. They didn't know there was someone else like them. Yes! My favorite part was swinging the bat. I definitely didn't think I would have been able to hit the ball, but I did hit the ball and I was proud of myself and I ran to first base and it was so much fun. Creating this camp is touching kids. I can see it. <laughs> it is everything we wanted and more. <laughs> Whatever you can put your mind to, you can do. Don't let your disabilities take that away from you. You can do anything. How wonderful is that? The camp was started in honor of Martil Reinsdorf, the late wife of White Sox owner Jerry Reinsdorf. She made coloring books with darker lines for visually impaired children. Campers also recently visited the Morton Arboretum. They're learning to make pizzas tomorrow and going to the zoo on Friday.